Welcome to Yoga Joe Yoga for Kids Halloween Special Edition. Today we're going to do some practices that are proper spooky, but it's just to give you an idea what you can do today at home, at school, or just on your own. So let's start with this spooky Halloween -y session, but in a yogic way, okay? So sit down with your legs nice and crossed and we start with some breathing. So breathe in, lift your hands up like a scary monster and breathe out like a scary ghost. Ooh. Breathe in, lift your hands up, scary monster and breathe out, scary ghost. Ooh. And one more time, lift up, Scary monster and breathe out. Ooh. Good. Now, every Halloween has a black cat, doesn't it? So, shall we do a cat? We've got a cat pose in yoga. So, we've got get on your foot and now push your spine up to the ceiling and see. A proper wicked Halloween which is cat and lift your belly down and again lift your back up and down and lift your uh, back up nice curve and relax shall we do one more Lift your back up nice and curly and nice and scary and as she exhales Good. So what's the next creature of Halloween night? Werewolf! Right, so let's get into downward dog first. So nice straight legs, nice straight hands. Try your feet with a nice and flat on the floor. And then lift your one hand and try and see if you can grab your opposite ankle. And then turn your head underneath your armpit and say, Good. Now put your hand back on the floor. And do it the same on the other hand, lift your other hand and grab diagonally your ankle and say, Ow! What? <laughs> yeah, already I was close. That would be a very injured werewolf, wouldn't it? Let's try again. Lift your bum up into downward dog pose and now lift your one hand and grab your opposite ankle on the back. Turn your head underneath your armpit. Breathe in, and as you breathe out, do a massive oh. Now slowly put your hand back, and lift your other hand, and grab your other ankle, and say, oh. Oh. Good, relax your knees, and now, Halloween is also a night of spiders. So we can't have spiders here, they're really awful. So let's get into our feet like that. Put your feet nice and wide, right? And now bend forward, cross your hands and put them on the floor. Bend your knees and sit down. And see if you can do a little spidery walk. Can you do that? Just a little creepy spidery walk. Oh, don't forget to breathe. We can breathe in a scary way. Breathe in through your nose and breathe out like a ghost. Ooh. Again, lift your hands up, keep your knees bent, and woo. 
mine. So who else have we got on Halloween? <gasps> a witch! <laughs> yes! So now here we've got our broomsticks. So Ooh. we can do a witch <laughs> using a yoga pose called chair. So put your broomstick between your legs. Keep your knees and your feet nice and close and almost imagine you're sitting down on your broom. Yeah? And now lift your hands up as if you were flying. Sit down, squat those legs nice and down. And let's fly Ooh. and fly and fly. See how your broom is just cruising across the sky and breathe like a wind. Ooh. 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 Right. I think we need to give our legs a little bit of rest, shall we? Right, shall we do the mummy walk? So for this one, bring your legs nice and close. Sit down. Hands in front of you. Maybe a little bit creepy. One higher, the other one lower. Lift your heels up. And now do a walk of a mummy. Ah. Breathe in through your nose. And breathe out. Ah. Breathe in through your nose. And ah. Good. Now squat low. Bring your heels close, your toes out, and now let's do a creepy dance a spider, the, the, the spider dance. And let's dance into the corpse pose, <sighs> dead body pose. So just lie down like a dead body, pull your hands out, legs out. Legs out, hands out, and don't move, because we're dead. Breathe in through your nose, and out through your mouth. Today, have a lovely Halloween evening, and we will see you soon. Bye. <laughs> You've been watching Yoga Joe Hatha for Happy Families. Yay! Yay! <laughs> Join us by hitting the like button. The subscribe button and click on the post notifications bell down below.